The amount of our students that come have no formal qualifications. They would have been through a different system themselves. So for many of the students, it's the first real academic experience. We put a lot of emphasis on personal development. We put a lot, a lot of emphasis on skills, working with young people, and really use the life experience that a lot of the students have and turn that into a little bit more of a theoretical experience for them. We have a level six now, so if they do youth studies level five, they can go on then to do level six in community development. NUI Minute set this course up, so we're seen really as the feeder course for a lot of the students to progress on to NUI Minute. This year we are offering three types of childcare courses, one year of childcare course. Uh, the first one is pure nine modules on childcare education, early childhood care and education. And the second course would offer uh, the nine modules, but there would be a module based on high scope, which is another um, aspect or introduction to childcare, uh, approach to childcare, like Montessori. And the third one this year is the childcare with an after school element to it, uh, where we would offer a module on after school care and also on child minding. We offer a two day work placement per week in a nursery environment or an after school facility, um, and that's in that invaluable region students. Our students unusually have a very good direct entry access to both chemistry and Blanchettstown IT for their computer science degrees. And Blanchettstown is our mother, they train us. Chemistry are in regularly looking for our students to go. Mature students can also go directly in the second year. So we are really equipping them for progression. Even students who don't have a very good educational history, due to the training they get here, find university life a lot easier than they would have done gone straight in without doing our training. Things like word processing, spreadsheets, not really what we're interested in. We're kind of interested in somebody who wants to open up a computer and see what's in it. The well, main aim is that the students that come here prepare a portfolio for the end of the year that they can go to other colleges in third level to apply for those courses. They also do the portfolio uh, practice for NCAD. The main things that we'll be covering is developing their drawing skills, first of all, uh, their presentation skills. They'd also be working in a variety of mediums like uh, sculpture, ceramics, printing and metal. Digital would be quite important as well in terms of computers and photography. I think the location is a big thing. They're in the city centre. gives them a lot of access to really interesting places, galleries, museums and resources. trying to prepare people for first year university in the art social science type area. We offer our sociology, European studies, English lit, history, psychology, political studies. We also offer uh, four support subjects, so these are the research and study skills, communication skills, uh, person professional development and IT. We're just back from Berlin, for example. We had a great trip there last week, a European studies trip. We met students in a college there, an FE college in Berlin. So, I say general education is what we're talking, as well as people on their own individual path. Uh, so, as much happens in the canteen sometimes as in the classroom. One of the best things around about the college experience is how students and staff engage with one another in terms of teaching and learning because we have students coming from very, very different backgrounds. School leavers, people with kind of interesting careers that you know, have done very many different things, people who have been unemployed for a long time. So it's not the same response to everybody.